Brian Gomez with the Gazette. I'm back here at my apartment. I just had to get out of World Arena. I was absolutely disgusted by what I saw tonight from Colorado College, and CC should really be embarrassed. The Tigers losing 3-1 to tonight to Michigan Tech in the best of three first round WCHA playoff opener. The Tigers just brought nothing to the table. They were outshot 29-17. to They somehow held a 40-18 to face-off advantage, yet every time they won the puck, they seemed to just cough it up. They were uninspired. They were sloppy. They were careless. They put no pressure on Michigan Tech. They were just totally dominated in the biggest game of the season to not bring any sort of effort, any sort of enthusiasm. It's just mind-boggling. Despite all that, though, CC was tied 1-1 to in the third period after Ryland Schwartz scored on a 5-on-3 goal. Michigan Tech, though, responded with a goal from Dennis Ricks three minutes later, and then a goal from Alex McLeod with nine and a half minutes left sealed the deal. CC needs a win on Saturday to force a game three on Sunday. It's a really precarious situation for the Tigers. We had Jaden's breakaway and McDermott's uh, off the post early. That might have set the tone, might have been a little bit different, but they didn't go in for us tonight. You know, we hung around the first period. I think shots were eight to eight. Uh, the second period is where they really took control and where they really, uh, you know, got after us and were beating us to pucks. And, and, and then they, they tightened up uh, defensively very well. So I, I give them credit. I thought they were outstanding. That being said, we still had uh, the five and three to start the third, and, and we were able to convert. And then uh, we had a little bit of momentum. Um, but, uh, you know, what a couple defensive breakdowns, and, and, uh, and they're off to the races. I, I thought they played extremely well. I was disappointed with our ability to win some puck battles and, and to get to the net. I mean, 17 shots or whatever ended up is, you know, against, uh, against any team uh, is not acceptable. We had a chance to set the tone in the first period, and it just didn't go for us. And there were rebounds in the first. And then they, they adjusted, and they, played, they brought guys down lower. And um, uh, we really got very few good looks at the net. But they had great jump. I thought they were so, so quick on pucks, and, and, um, and um, they were able to uh, force us into mistakes and turnovers because of their quickness. And then as it went on, you know, we lost Colette early, and we had to go to three lines. So, I mean, I, that certainly didn't help us when we played not only nine forwards tonight. And, I think that wore down a little bit for us, and and um, but you got to give them credit because they got after it pretty good. They were forechecking aggressively. They were they were taking away the walls. Uh, we were turning the puck over on the wall a little bit. I thought their forecheck was very strong, um, keeping us bottled up. You know there was a couple shifts there. You know half a dozen shifts anyway that they kept us bottled up well, and um, and we couldn't break it out. I mean we were down to Wisconsin and we were actually down two nothing on the Saturday game too, and but we're able to come back. And you know I mean the guys have been in that situation, but. You know what, it's going to take a heck of a team effort and everybody's going to have to pull together. I think they just got on a roll. Um, they were playing well. They caught us, you know, at, at a time that we weren't, you know, we were kind of on our heels. We weren't playing our best and uh, it's something that we have to figure out and we have to improve on and have to sort it out really quickly and figure it out for tomorrow. You know, you got to give them some credit. They played, you know, played a decent game. And, you know, the fact is there were opportunities to take advantage of this game and we just didn't take advantage of them. Scoring a goal first would be nice. You know, that's always our, it's always a nice goal to have, especially in a big playoff game like this. And uh, just, uh, you know, right from early on, a couple of bounces didn't go our way and then we just couldn't put the puck in the net and capitalize on some opportunities. We had a few chances early on and uh, we didn't score on them and uh, the momentum stayed on their side. They're uh, definitely the better team tonight. Uh, they're in our end most of the game. Um, you know, after that power play goal, uh, he thought we should have got momentum back, but they scored right after and uh, just kept going. I think we just need more jump off the start and, like you said, uh, finish on our opportunities. Um, you know, just play a cleaner D zone. I think uh, we just got to keep our speed up and keep the puck in there. And last weekend we won both, although they may have outplayed us in one, but uh, we found a way to win it. And uh, basically now our backs are against the wall and uh, got to win every game from here on out.